Hey guys. So, as you know, I was having some fuel issues. <laughs> that it actually went. <laughs> the horse. Uh, unicorn. Uh, actually, I had a fuel, fuel issue. I was running out of fuel on my scooter. So I'm afraid I would be stuck somewhere. So that's why now we are going for fuel petrol station hunt. <laughs> I need to refuel him up. Him. A Scotty, Scotty. I named him Scotty because he's a scooter, you know, Scotty. And it beams me wherever I want to go, so it's Scotty. And we are going to the main road that goes to Karekeya, Karekireya, ah, the capital of Corfu. So somewhere there, I, I think I should find a gas station. So you can take this ride together with me. And if you come to Corfu, you know where to refill your Scotty, Scotty, your Scotty. <laughs> Let me harness up and we'll be ready to go. Uh -oh. Big Joe! Cheap travels. Travel on a budget. I'm all harnessed up. Now let's start this scooty, Scotty. Yeah, it started. Now let's try to get on the main road. Not get killed in the process. Yippee. So, the hunt for the petrol station begins now. The guy that I rented this scooter from said it's like 3 or 4 kilometers outside of this city, the city of Cabos. So, I think that city where the gas station is, is actually uh, goes under the city of Lefkimi. Uh, if you watch one of my previous videos, you can see how Lefkimi city looks like. And I also took a scooter right there, so you know how to get there. So we always pass this abandoned building on the right side that wanted to be a hotel, or was a hotel one time. And maybe on the way back we can St. Peter Beach. We can stop on this St. Peter Beach. We haven't been there before. Here another abandoned restaurant, Flamingo Bar. Not working anymore. But on the other side, the bar is working, I think. Oh, my hands are so red. The sun will burn me. Oh my god. I will become an Indian. Sorry, Native American. <laughs> Let's hope the fuel holds. It's on the red already. But it's not on the EE, -E, which means empty. Ah, there are holes in the road, holes in the road. Very dangerous. Especially if you drive scooter at night, you go in this hole and bye-bye. Accident happening, you know? So yeah, you should be extremely careful while driving on a Greek road, you know? But it's just impossible to, to, to avoid it, you know. So, when we will get to the intersection, we must go left. I checked on Google Maps, and then uh, on the left or on the right side, we look for our gas station. It's basically the main road that goes from Corfu uh, capital to Cabos. And I will be so sorry I put the gas inside because the gas price is here. When I was arriving, I saw two euros fifty cents or two forty-eight, something like that. So two euros fifty for one liter of gas. My God! They really 
Alpha 5 rise is going to reach. And I think the fuel shortage will only continue, so we can only expect for them to rise, my god. Olive trees. These are olive trees, this I know. But well, those bigger ones, I'm not sure. If they're olives or maybe they're wild olives or something like that. I'm not, I'm not sure. Maybe they're not. You see this one, these trees that there now. Are those olive trees too? Olive trees gone wild? Maybe. I don't, I'm not sure. If anybody knows, write me in comments, please. So we have bus cleaner here. Lord's Travel. I also took them for airport transport to transfer me to Tavos. Well, I bought it through my site that you can find in the description. Well, you will find it in the description when I do the descriptions because <laughs> I cannot do them now here in holiday. When I'm holidaying, you know. <laughs> because I didn't take the computer with me and I need a computer for that. So yeah, we're coming closer to the intersection where we will go left. And then somewhere around there, a gas station will appear. That's the matrix system we live in. I thought of it, ah, oh. <laughs> that's the matrix system that we live in, and uh, yeah, ah, <laughs> not hole. Okay, not too far. So let's put our signal. Check, 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 check. We come to this non functioning traffic lights. Uh, Romania in front of me. This will take a while. Romanian woman driving a car. My god. My god. My god. My god. My god. We go really left. Okay. I take my way. So, the hunt for the gas station. <laughs> Again, this is like the highway. <laughs> it's not really a highway, but it's like a wide road, you know. Now uh, it's good. Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see some sign. It might be the gas station there. Uh, on the right side. Let's hope that's the gas station. Maybe, 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 Jet oil, yeah. Let's go to jet oil. Jet oil, LPG. No, I need the uh, other gas. <laughs> 95. Ah, they have cards. Okay, so maybe I can pay with card. So two euros. 43.9. Okay. Now we just have to find somewhere that has 95, and I found it. So, yay. Now, how do you open this contraction? Ah. Ah, so easy. Uh, now, what do, I, what do I do with this? Let's put it here. Ah, hello. Oh, 95 full. Yeah. Thank you. That the Euros go. <laughs> or is it more? Like that. 12 Euros. Let's see, so expensive, yes. <laughs> oh my god. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. 
So we put almost five liters inside. Oh my gosh! I hope it lasts for <laughs> one week. <laughs> uh, and now, while we're here, we can go to Lidl, I think, to restock on my beers. I think I have only one left, so uh, I think we'll do that. So while we're driving, I will also show you another way. Now, how to get directly from Kavos to Lidl. <laughs> Not only to the gas station, but if you make it to the gas station, look now. <laughs> the fuel is going up. I don't know if you see it. So dark, no weather. See, now this Samsung is doing things when I try to focus. See, full tank. So, let's go to find Lidl now. There's this. Does it start? Yeah. Okay. So let's go! Let's put you a little bit up like this. So you don't see the okay. okay. There's the river Potami. If you go here on the right side now here. You will go to to Lefkimi, to the village of Lefkimi, which is very nice to the canal, to the river here on this side. It's nice to go there. I had calamari there. They were a little bit a little bit greasy, but okay. It's a nice experience and you can check out different restaurants there also. They are less expensive than in Cabos, you know. I paid for calamari like nine euros, something like that. Big Joe, cheap travels, left him in, and you'll find it, I'm sure. So now the Lidl should be somewhere on the left side. I am not sure how many kilometers exactly. Maybe one, two. I think less than one. Let's go down. Who knows? I don't know. I'm not from here. I'm not Greek. slowly 30 kilometers per hour safe speed <laughs> we could have gone have gone 40 kilometers but okay i'm taking it easy you know <laughs> it's better than walking you know ah, it's if you walk this way maybe oh, two three hours from our hotel <laughs> and with backpack uh, full uh, i would feel like a mule or a donkey carrying all that stuff at least now I'm driving all this stuff. I still feel like a donkey. <laughs> As you can see, not, not so much traffic. Every, I don't know, five minutes some car comes by. So it's really an enjoyment to drive you know, on these big roads, you know, on the islands. Uh, it's really nice. Not much traffic nature. The only thing you have to be aware is the bad condition of the roads, you know? the potholes, the holes, the up and downs of the asphalt. <laughs> and you have to wear a helmet if the police stops you, you will pay a fine. You know? Otherwise I would not <laughs> wear it. But I think. I think it's on this intersection, but I am not completely sure. Oh, this is the main road that goes to the airport or the capital of Corfu. Karike, Karikre, Karikere. Oh my god. I must remember the name. I always forget. And yeah, the gold. Here you can see a small church, like a chapel. Say some prayers. Yeah, I think it's here on the left side now. Are you there? Legal, are you there? Tell me, answer me. God damn it, answer me. 
<laughs> no, it's not there. So still more, 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 more. Okay. Okay. It's like a farmer's market there. They're selling some fruits, I think, and veggies on the stalls outside. And this beach, AG. For this, we will go every tomorrow. Because I want to explore different beaches. Different beaches. <laughs> yeah, I hope you get my camera. <laughs> Driving in the sun, driving in the sun. Wind is blowing hard, but we're driving in the sun. We don't know that we go so far last time. So another shell is in 3.5 kilometers. If you don't like this gas station and want to have shell fuel in your scooter, 3.5 kilometers this way. <laughs> now I am putting gas to the max because we are going up and my velocity is 43 kilometers my god this is really that speed <laughs> uh, it's only 50 cc you know it's a moped so that's why it's not a bad road oh yeah 125 would be much better I could go 50 with that one or even 60 oh some big truck is coming ah I thought it was a truck Damn you, buggy! Damn you! <laughs> yeah, it really sounded like a truck. Okay, so now we're picking speed. We're going 40 per kilometers per, per hour here. Yeah. Because we're going down, of course. <laughs> yeah, I have my silly little there, so... Let me check the mirror in our cars. And let us put this blinker on. Is it blinker? Blinker, yeah, blinker. And he will go to the left. So this little, even though it's, it's Saturday today, it's open until 8 o'clock in the evening, if you were wondering. But for, for Sunday, I don't know. I only checked for today. Well, Google told me it's open. <laughs> I can't stop blinking. And where do we park? We park in the shadow there, I see it. I see the shade, I see the shade, I see the shade. And we park here. Well, we will continue the video when I come back from the shop. So, I thought we would be able to go back to the beach, but look, my backpack is so full. I have to go back to accommodation, so we go back to the Sandwich Hotel. All harnessed up and away we go. As soon as my bike starts. <laughs> away we go. It's really heavy my backpack now. <laughs> I bought food. <laughs> Salami, cheeses and of course some beers. Which is the heaviest. So, I'll have my breakfast from now on at home. And for all, I pay like 34 euros, like one salami, one parmigiano pecorino, that's cheese from the sheep, one, two Mars bars, some like uh, salty sticks, popcorn, what else? Uh, 24 beers. <laughs> And I, uh, I bought kumquat as a special drink, drink, not even a drink, but special for only Corfu Islands. So I'll be trying that, I'll make a special video of that. Um, what else did I get? That's it. Oh, and some more salami, some like uh, dried up salami, you know, I like that stuff. Maybe we'll do a video of breakfast. <laughs> so 
uh, I gotta put some stuff, food, in the refrigerator now. And then I'll be too tired to go to <laughs> the beach again. Because it's like 5 or 6 o'clock already. But this should be the best time to go to the beach because uh, the sun is not so strong now. It's still strong, but not as strong as, uh, let's say, midday, you know? 12 o'clock. I don't know what I'll do. I have no plans. I know I'll have a beer and then I'll think about what to do. <laughs> Let me go back to the If I have a beer or two, then I cannot drive it out. I'm so relieved my tank is full now. <laughs> I don't have to worry about gas anymore. Yes, yeah, so we still don't know why this shop is DLS. I think it's like a big shop. I have to check it one day. Maybe it's cheaper than Lidl. Who knows? If you have that card, little plus, and you're not from Greece, Greek, if it's, the card is not Greek, you know, uh, it doesn't work from the other countries, so, just so you know. Is it here? I think it's still straight, yeah, okay. Boca Beach. Uh, if you watch my video, the way to left came in, I stopped at that Boca Beach. It's a nice beach, but I think only locals were there. And you can see from there clearly, like, I don't know if it's Greece mainland or Albania, I'm not sure. When I go to shop, I always have a backpack with me because I put everything there and then I, <laughs> I am harnessed up from the front and from the back. In the front, I have a harness for the phone, in the back, I have a backpack. So, yeah, I, I really am like a mule, you know, <laughs> or a donkey. <laughs> Beach, Boca, Boca Beach. If you go left, you pass left Timi and you just continue on and you get to Boca Beach. You just continue on uh, where the canal goes, you know, the river. So, the river will lead you to Boca Beach. And jet oil on the left where we refuel. So, Tavos Town should be now on the right side. I see the traffic light that doesn't work there in the distance. So there we will turn right. Let's go, let's go, I want to go 40, 40 km. No, <laughs> no I have a backpack, it goes 35. <laughs> doesn't want to go 40. Ah, okay, it's a little climb here, maybe that's why. But yeah, I think 20 kilos more on my back, so... 
a lot of kilos. We are talking in hundreds of kilos. <laughs> On this poor Scotty scooter. <laughs> no, it wasn't this. Ah, next, next, the next one, okay. At the intersection with the non working uh, lights, we go right, 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 left, right, it's right. <laughs> Right here. Turn right. If you want to go to left, give me a turn left. If you want to go to port, you go straight. So this road leads you straight to port, where the tours go to other islands. If you book a tour, but they usually pick up from hotel, so you don't have to worry about that. prices of beer. As I told you, if I buy in the shop that's just under my hotel, I would pay 1 euro 80 cents for the cheapest beer. And here in Lidl, we have beers from 0.69. We get that far Argus, something like that, for with 4.5%. And I think I've paid 0.79, so 80 cents for a beer that has like a 5% alcohol, so like a normal lager beer, you know, with 5% alcohol. So yeah, it's worth a trip, you know. <laughs> if you rent a scooter, you should go there. Or to any other bigger supermarket, because the prices would be cheaper. Did you just travel tips? <laughs> Always find a local supermarket and buy there. Not a private one, because they have higher prices. Traveling one-on-one. -on -one. <laughs> oh, this one. Apricots on the tree. Fancy hotel apartments on the left. And our supermarket, I think we are close to our hotel. In 14 days, the time you are, I'll get used to see the things and where things are. Maybe not too crazy Greek driver. <laughs> have to pass that abandoned hotel building. I don't think we passed it yet. Look, no scooter. Can you make it to 40? Yay! We are going 40 kilometers per hour now. <laughs> the maximum speed of this scooter. <laughs> Maybe it's more bad gas if we go 40.
god, this backpack is so wearing me down, you know. <laughs> Whoa, we are here. I didn't even know we passed that building. So it's okay. Our park is here under this tree. Here we are. And this was our trip. Our hunt for the gas station, which was successful. Yeah, guys. Be sure to like this video, comment down if you liked it. And uh, yeah, <laughs> see you in the next video. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you subscribe to my channel, put a like there and see you next time.